Okay, and welcome back. And I have late breaking news on the LG Stylus 2. Uh, first of all, this phone is becoming something of a big deal. It was already a big deal to me when the original LG G Stylo was released, but now with the LG Stylus 2 is the first phone to support DAB radio. Now, what is DAB radio? I have no idea, but we know it's got to be something similar to uh, Pandora or Tidal or one of your uh, apps that you could download that support uh, streaming radio. Is this the death of FM radio? Um, uh, kind of, sort of, I would say, because I think that uh, as long as you're making <laughs> flip phones and phones that are like in the 90s or the <laughs> early, late 80s, they probably would always use a FM uh, <laughs> radio, you know, because of the fact that it's cheap and easy to manufacture. But anyways, uh, the LG... Stylus 2 was originally announced ahead of this year's MWC, but the headset seems to have picked up a new feature since then, at least in European and Australian markets. The smartphone is the first to include DAB radio support in these regions as a data-friendly alternative to streaming audio from the web. Now, we as Americans, we know that no matter where this phone gets released first, if we want it, we shall have it because we have places like Amazon and a whole lot more uh, ways to get phones that's not released in the United States. But this phone will be released in North America first. Uh, I mean, secondly, once it hit European and Australia. So uh, we, more than likely, we will get an edition of this phone somewhere in the United States pretty soon here. Uh, this version of the LG Stylus 2 features a dedicated DAB chipset and an additional app that allows customers to enjoy digital radio broadcasts out of the box. The app offers station recommendations and has an improved dis discovery engine. DAB and DAB plus radio signals are common in Europe and can also be found in Australia. Other regions have adapted to different standards such as HD radio in the U.S., so this particular model won't go on sale in other countries. DAB offers some advantages over regular DAB in this MPEG2 encoding. It makes use of AAC+, Plus, which offers increased audio quality at small bit rates. The two standards also make use of the same hardware. So the LG Silas 2 will work with both formats whenever they are available. The DAB version of the LG Stylus otherwise retains identical hardware to that which was announced back in February. It's still a 5.7 inch 720 display, a 1.2 gigahertz quad core processor, a 1.5 gigabyte of RAM, 13 megapixel rear camera, 8 megapixel front camera, I'm excited about that, and a 3000 milliamp battery, and it comes complete with a stylus. Consumers in Australia, Belgium, Germany, Italy, Netherlands, Norway, and the United Kingdom will be the first to receive the LG Silas with DAB radio support, which we knew this. We knew it was going to be released uh, in these other countries first to get their money, and then it would drop in America where it will cash out. But I will keep you guys in the know. Every time I hear something, as you can tell, I am in the news. Like this video, and I can't wait for this LG G Stylus 2 to drop here. I'm very excited about this. And subscribe. I will see you guys in the next video. Later.